took her to a, uh, whatever it's called, a swimming aerobics thing today, and um, we'll pick her up. We're taking pictures today. No, I'm recording stuff today. Oh, you're recording stuff today. Yeah. Okay. It's called a vlog, like a video log. Uh-huh. And I started yesterday. <laughs> and I felt I feel like doing it. <laughs> Everybody, this is my grandma. <laughs> my grandma. Hi. I don't even know if the camera's pointing at my face because I'm focused on driving. Here, do you want to take it? You can film me if you want. Hi. Hi. Ooh, what pretty scenery. <laughs> oh, look at the dog. Aww. There's people. But look at the dog. Macaroons. I am not sure how I feel about that. I'm nice. I put the cart, don't mind me. I put the cart back where it's supposed to go. Probably a lot of the videos in the car are going to be like this. So they're going to be like, you know, up and down rather than uh, full. <laughs> My bad. Hi everyone. Um, so today I figured I would show you some of my cosplay props. You are very loud. That's my dog. Anyway, I'm gonna show you some of my cosplay props. I wanna show you some of like my collectibles, some of my manga, just like a whole bunch of stuff. So stay tuned. This is my guest bed. Um, it's got these guys on it and normally I just let people like take them off because there's like only room for a dog, <laughs> basically. This is my bookshelf in my guest bedroom. It's got cosplay stuff on top, and it's got Harry Potter, and some miscellaneous stuff, and more books, and game guides, and stuff like that, and comic books down there. This is my room, but I'm only going to show you my bookshelves because that's the only interesting part. My manga starts from A, over there. Oh, that right there, that's my, my doggie's paw print. So, starts from A, goes down, there's Black Butler stuff, Sailor Moon stuff. You guys remember Beyblade? I loved Beyblade. Those guys I got, I think, from Burger King. I, <laughs> I really don't remember. But there's that, and South Park, Tokidoki stuff. Get backers. I made that. It was gonna turn into a plush toy, but I never finished it. Big Tiki I'm gonna give to my niece because she loves Miraculous Ladybug. Some of this stuff. This is this one I think is really cool. It's like a little spider dude. At Kakashi, I actually got from my friend Brianna because she didn't want it anymore. And I was like, I have literally like no Naruto stuff besides my manga. So there's that and those and over here there's my oh my legend of Zelda stuff. That is named after my friend Erica, so that's an Erica cat. <laughs> These are all of my really old, like, child stuffed animals. That is supposed to be me. <laughs> There's my cat, I never named her, and then Douglas. This is like, I haven't done anything with yet, except for like Sailor Moon. This is my downstairs. This is where I live, because I still live at home, unfortunately. There's some Pokemon, My Little Pony turtles, um, some other stuff that I like to collect. These are all my video games and movies. These are all my game stuff. These are some of my figures. This is what I got in here. There's Kingdom Hearts and Final Fantasy, a little bit of Walking Dead and Five Nights at Freddy stuff. And here I have Digimon, Pokemon, Yu-Gi-Oh, Dragon Ball Z stuff, a little bit of Hamtaro and a Lion King figure right there. Right here is where I have my My Little Pony stuff. Down here, there's some Amiibo stuff and Marvel. All right, so this next part, I'm going to show you guys some of my favorite uh, cosplay props that I have. My first one is the Legend of Zelda. Like, it's like a kid toy. But it's the Legend of Zelda um, arrow, like bow and arrow thing. Like, 
again, it's a freaking kid toy. And then my next one that I like, um, I have only used it once, is the Joker little, like, cane thing. Um, I've only used it once. Um, if you notice on both of these, they have, you know, like paper wrist things. This is what you would call peace bonding at conventions and stuff like that. So that basically means you promise not to harm anybody. You promise not to use it in like a threatening way so that you can actually use it and like do stuff with it, you know, like at the the convention and stuff. This is my Legend of Zelda Master Sword. Same thing. I think it's got two of them on there now. Yeah. Next. So this is this is my very first prop that I've ever used ever in my life. Yep. For those of you who don't know what it is, it's a tree trimmer. An actual tree trimmer that I put tape on. I and mean, it's also got piece bonded, got piece bonded twice. I don't know why, because one, it's metal. And two, it's like, it's real. The only reason I'm pretty sure I got away with it is because I duct taped it and you literally like can't move it. Like this is how you're supposed to use it. You're supposed to pull this back. It does not close at all. So there are actual blades in here that I duct taped to look like um, the scythe that William, I think his full name is William T. Spears uses in uh, Black Butler. And then these you can't really use in a cosplay, or not cosplay, but in a um, convention setting because they are metal and most conventions do not allow you to use metal props. This is a Keyblade! I got this at um, Starfest uh, via reveal, quote unquote, is uh, in my uh, Starfest um, vlog that I did a few years ago. And it's like legit, like it, it doesn't, it's not sharp or anything, but it is like metal, like it's metal. Just as well, um, I have another Keyblade that I've never used that I also got at Starfest. It's also one of my favorites just because, you know, it's a Keyblade. <laughs> I love Keyblades. I have a surprise. I have a Hohenheim mini card. <laughs> Some of you can see him. He's acting pretty crazy right now because he loves car rides. Like, he loves car rides. Where'd he go? Hi, Base Mom! <laughs> hey, sweetheart. He's like, hi, Mom! Come on. I'll go break my glasses. All right, everybody, that's it for this vlog. Thanks for watching. If you liked it, go ahead and leave a thumbs up. If not, you're free to give it a thumbs down. Had fun today with Grandma and got to pick up Erica. Hohenheim was crazy. He's always crazy. <laughs> but yeah, so I'll see you guys in the next video.